back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. If you click the thumbnail, you're going to check out some more Dimash. I'm still working on the name, but I'm pretty sure that's how you guys have told me to pronounce it. Dimash? Either way, this is a, a singer that I've just got exposed to from Kazakhstan, I believe. You guys have let me know. And he is one of, if not the most unique singers that I think I've, I've listened to on this channel or you know ever he's got such an interesting range and it goes all over the place and there's just sounds coming out of him that i didn't know could really come out of a human and one thing that you guys kept telling me is i need to keep going down the catalog so i'm going to keep doing that one but one that popped up that i was like there's no way and that's one movie that i've really enjoyed throughout most of my life since it came out was the fifth element bruce willis classic but there was a specific scene in that one towards the end where there's an action scene that happens and they were going to this concert where it was the the diva. I forgot her actual name in that one, but she sings. It's like opera-ish, but she, she does like all these different octaves and things like that that are really seem like unhuman. Like it was like, this is an alien. This is clearly why she's able to do this because she's an alien because it's not real. And you guys let me know that Dimash has actually done that. So, of course, I have to check that out. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do now. So let's go ahead and pull this one up. It's called the the diva dance. Let's give it a listen. I think it's actually two songs.
right. So that was that was absolutely the the diva song from the Fifth Element, the one that I really didn't think could be made by an actual human that had to be digital and nope, he just did that. That's it is so odd. I did not know that you could really. He's got such a powerful voice, but can make it so high and then low a little bit as well. But then in the previous song that he was singing, which I think it was Italian, it was very dramatic. And he had a very, you know, consistent tone for like the first part of it and then just took over with his overwhelming power. And again, like I keep wanting to say like operatic voice because it makes me think of that. But I think that was also because the first part of the song was very... uh, very dramatic you know there was a lot going on with the dancer that was there and the environment it was very good and very fitting for the song and then he got into the diva one and the lights came on and again it fit very well and then the sounds were all over the place just like in the movie and he definitely was able to do that i don't think i've seen anybody else try and actually do that song without you know some sort of uh, electronic help so that's pretty ridiculous and awesome so (laughs) please let me know more to check out very amazed by this guy and just not really knowing what to expect from him each time because it just keeps going in different directions in the best possible way but let me know in the comment section don't forget like share subscribe go hit that subscribe button if you would that'd be fantastic and as always you're awesome peace out